Welcome to Planet Golf's review of the Shriners Children's Open. All the information I'm about to give you you can find at planetgolfreview.com and that is all the links through to the best odds that we've found so far. And don't forget to subscribe, that way you'll get a notification when new videos go live. Slight like change this week, two tips to win. Tom Kim 14 to 1 and Ludwig Oberg also 14 to 1 with Bet365. And Tom, well, he's this week's defending champion, shot minus 24 last year and uh, won by three shots. Hasn't played since the Tour Championship, but he finished last season with five top 25 finishes from his last five starts, including runner-up at the Open Championship and two other top 10s. Ludwig, well, he seems to be running on adrenaline at the moment after the Ryder Cup. Tees it up last week at the Sunson's Farm and ends up in the playoff, which he lost. And he's teeing it up again this week, which I was quite surprised at. But if he's teeing it up, I expect him to be right in the thick of it. Each way tips Adam Hadwin 45 to 1 with Bet365, Tom Hoagie 40 to 1 with Bet Fred, Christian Besignal 60 to 1 with Paddy Power. Adam has had four top 10 finishes from his seven starts in this event, so he'll want to get off to his autumn season to get off to a quick start. Tom Ho comes into this event on the back of a top 15 finish at the weekend. He has four top 25 finishes, including his fourth place finish here last year. Christian, well, this is the second time he'll be playing in this event. And he had a top 20 finish here last year. And he comes into this week on the back of a sixth place finish at the Sands of the Suns Farms. And the outside tip, Matthew Neesmith, 80-1 to one with Paddy Power. And he's had... Four starts in this event and has not been outside the top 20 and that includes two top 10 finishes and one of which was last year's runner-up finish and comes into this week on the back of his top 25 finish at the weekend. And longer odds try Martin Laird, 100 to 1. With Paddy Power, he has two wins and a runner-up in this event. As always, there's only one real winner and that's the bookies. So just bet for fun, but have a great weekend. Good luck. Bye for now.